A bill focusing on wolf hunting is advancing in the state Senate. Catherine Silver spoke to members of the Northwoods Wolf Alliance about what the bill means for them. A crowd of people gathered at the American Indian Resource Center today to speak out about wolf hunting. Well, the wolves are very iconic. Um, when we have an, a, a, a policy in which, or a political climate in which it's acceptable to come and have a, 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 a hunt for fun on an animal that's so crucial to our ecosystem, I think it's a sign that things are really skewed. The Northwoods Wolf Alliance is a grassroots coalition that aims to stop the hunting and trapping of wolves. Their goal is to modify the bill currently in the Senate. Well, the Northwoods Wolf Alliance is actually trying to modify or change the bill. Um, we feel strongly about a couple of provisions in the bill that we're not happy with. And one of the things that we are doing is we're supporting Bob Schimmick and his efforts to get the tribal piece rewritten so that um, tribes have jurisdictional management over wolves within the exterior reservation boundaries. And what we're doing is do intervening on the House side and trying to get the language that's more suitable for our goals. The bill would call for an annual wolf population census, the creation of an advisory wolf task force, and to let tribes control hunting on their land. That deals with the checkerboard issue of ownership inside of reservation boundaries. So we feel that drawing a circle, if you will, around the exterior of the reservations and having tribal jurisdiction within that is the policy we want to advocate. What's special about today's presentation is there's an actual wolf here to teach people why these animals are so important. There was a real wolf and we got to take pictures with it and hang out with it a little bit and everyone was really excited. Founder Raina Crow hopes the rally will motivate people to speak to representatives about the policies they want. So when I look at having a wolf hunt in northern Minnesota, particularly, you know, northern Minnesota, I always see this as Anishinaabe country and to have people coming into ceded territory from the outside and killing an animal that is so important to the people, to me, Regardless of your culture, I think you need to step up and draw a line there. The Wolf Alliance hopes farmers and ranchers who are concerned about the loss of livestock due to wolves recognize their cultural significance. Catherine Silver, Lakeland News. In the future, the Northwoods Wolf Alliance plans to coordinate with other groups in Minnesota, Michigan, and Wisconsin to teach people about wolves. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.